all right hey leo what's going on it's natalie here doing a reading for you guys hope everyone is doing well so if you have leo anywhere in your chart this reading may resonate with you or this may resonate for the cross watcher okay so take it how it resonates all right holy spirit and angels what's the message please for leo sun moon rising and venus What's the message for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Refusing to see, huh? What else for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Surrender, I can release my need to control, and then we have patience. I accept that everything happens in divine order. All right, um... well-deserved reward teach and blame uh i guess someone is refusing to see that they've been let go or they had to like fight with themselves when it came to this and now they're finally seeing okay i've been let go all right let's see why is refusing to see here for leo someone was being very stubborn and impatient, maybe. Clarify refusing to see for Leo. What were they refusing to see? Five of Swords. Defeat, resentment, abuse, and conflict. Are they serious right now? Okay, uh, delayed success, incomplete, failed attempts, and stagnation. So someone was trying something over and over again, all right? They were probably like being mean or um, abusing somebody out of resentment. They didn't understand. Okay, so, so while they were doing this, they were failing at something here. Not understanding that what they were doing was causing a lack for them. Someone is like very stubborn, okay? They refuse to accept defeat. Oh, okay. Yeah, someone refused to accept defeat. Okay, faithlessness, discouragement, insecurity, and despair. Someone is very insecure. They refuse to see that they're very insecure. They don't see it. They're blind to the truth. This could be an air sign. Okay, hope, forgiveness, moving on, and healing. Five of Cups in the Reverse. Yeah, emptiness, block creativity, loneliness, and intuition. Someone is leaving this person and they're refusing to see it, man or woman. Seven of Swords. Yeah, deceit, theft, scammer, and cheating. What the heck? The Fool. Like, this person is stealing, too. Beginnings, innocent, adventure, and spontaneity. They just feel like, oh, I'll, I'll just steal again. I'll just do it again. Or I'll just cheat again. What's the fool with the seven of swords? Like, they're not getting it. Six of pentacles here. Charity, generosity, employment, and community. Someone steals from the community or something, and they refuse to see that what they're doing is wrong. It's a female. I should have known. A con um... A karmic Leo, shy, overbearing, self-conscious, and catty. But they're very insecure about their money. What the heck? So this person steals, but they don't have to steal. They steal when they don't have to steal. That's what's weird about this person. What's the Six of Pentacles for Leo? Yeah, the Devil Reverse. Release, restoring control, detachment. Someone is releasing this person here. But they're like not getting it. <laughs> Queen of Pentacles. Practical, business oriented, grounded, and generous. Someone is weird. Someone wants this uh, Queen of Pentacles life, I guess. But the Queen of Pentacles don't want to work with them. And they refuse to learn. Four of Wands, Wheel of Fortune. You don't want to work with someone that refuses to learn or like they... There's something very low vibrational about this person here. Someone doesn't understand that you don't want anything to do with them. This could be two feminines here. So this could be a friend of yours. 
They think this is a game. They feel like this is funny. All right, surrender. I can release my need to control. Nine of swords, nightmare, insomnia, anxiety, and fear. Someone's realizing they got to let something go. Yeah, lack of balance, extremes. They go to the extremes to do things, to cause discord. They're haunted right now. Four of Wands. Celebration, marriage, coming home and belonging. Someone is going back to where they belong. And someone refuses to see it. Someone could be going back to the Queen of Pentacles here. And they refuse to see that this Queen of Pentacles is getting married. Or they don't want this Queen of Pentacles to have a happy home. What's the Four of Wands? They feel like this is supposed to be their life, I guess. I don't know. Two of Swords. Yeah, they're blind to the truth. They don't see it. They don't care. Leo energy in a karmic sense. Not, not I'm not talking about high vibrational Leos. I'm talking about low vibrational Leos. They just don't get it sometimes. Yeah, heartbreak, trauma, grief, and depression. They're stuck in the past. They're not letting something go. They're very delusional. They don't want to see where someone is celebrating or that someone is worth celebrating with. What's the two of swords? The Leo. The Hierophant. Someone could be getting married. Tradition, conformity, morality, and ethics. Someone wants to go back to a tra traditional way of living. And this Leo, this karmic Leo that is, is like not okay with it. This could have been a mistress. She's not letting this go. What's the Hierophant with the Two of Swords? Ace of Wands. Yeah, someone wants to start a new beginning. Yeah, and they're getting rejected. Skeptical, apathy, negative outlook, contemplation. They don't like this. So there's a Leo out here that doesn't like conformity, rules, religion, marriage. It's a Jezebel spirit. Yeah, this King of Wands. This King of Wands is loyal to somebody or they're showing loyalty to somebody and this female just hates it. She also acts out of insecurity. She does petty things out of insecurity. She doesn't realize that it's really insecurity. She feels like it's a strength to be this way. She feels like it's a strength to be a thief or to steal people's destinies or steal people's money. What's the Four of Cups, Ace of Wands? Someone is very upset. Yeah, slow movement, delayed action, waiting game, impatient. Yeah, see, this person is always on the other side waiting and watching. Talkative, vigilance, use your head, energetic. I don't like this energy. This feels like, like a, a mistress. Queen of Swords here, honest, protective, witty, and intelligent. It's like this person will even wait on the side and wait for seconds. Like... This is weird. Like, this person is being patient. But it's like a annoying patience. Like, this person will wait forever for things to go her way. Like, even if she gets, like, the, the trash or the leftovers or, like... She's like a, a dog waiting at the trash can, waiting for someone to throw away their food. Like she's very, <laughs> she's impatient, but she's very patient for someone's seconds. It's very weird. What's patience here for Leo? Knight of Swords reverse, aggressive, out of control, irresponsible, bully. Page of Swords, energetic, talkative, vigilance, use your head. This person is definitely out of control. Ace of Swords. Something about communication is here. Yeah, the King of Cups. This King of Cups does not want this person. Compassionate, caring, affectionate, and friendly. I'm also going to like, whoever was with this person, they were people pleasing this person. They were telling this person to be patient and wait for them. But now this person is getting aggressive 
and spying. What's the King of Cups for Leo? Four of Pentacles reverse. Letting go, generosity, overspending, and no control. They have no control over what whatever this King of Cups is doing. Yeah, this is unrequited love. Financial collapse, fake money, family feud, and loss. And then there's the Empress. Someone could be more loyal to the uh, mother of their children or a mother figure than this person here. And they're just like, they just refuse to see it. I don't see what the problem is. What the four of Pentacles is? What's this here? Yeah, the Empress. Someone could be giving all their money to an Empress. For being patient. And they're not giving it to someone that's impatient. Yeah, King of Pentacles. They're trying to provide and make things go in their favor. <sighs> they're letting go of things around them. For an Empress here. Yeah, the Queen of Cups reverse. Selfish, overly sensitive, smothering, and spiteful. Someone is very selfish. They feel like the mother of someone's children doesn't deserve anything. And she does things out of spite for money. What the heck is wrong with this person? Do you see this person for who they are? Or this masculine sees this person for who they are now? What's the Queen of Cups reverse? I don't know why this person feels like they deserve your life or something. I don't really even feel like, like you could not even be this, this masculine's person, but this person wants to come towards you. Yeah. No fight left. Stalemate retreat recovery. Okay. So it looks like they're letting go. Yeah. They're accepting defeat here because ain't no way this is annoying. Yeah. Resolution coming together, battle fatigue, suppressed emotion. They're tired of fighting. They're tired of fighting this masculine. They're trying. They're tired of stopping this person from coming towards you. Tower. Sudden upheaval. Broken pride. Disaster. Renovation. Now they have to like change everything up in their life. Making plans. New job. Practicality of potential. Yeah, someone has to find a job. Yeah, they got a plan for the future. Or this masculine is trying to plan for the future. They didn't expect this to happen. They're not involved in their future. They're not They're not part of their future. They're not realizing this. They're just a side chick or something. They thought that they would be involved in this masculine's plans. So either you're a Leo, the masculine's a Leo, or the feminine, the, you know, the karmic feminine is a Leo. I'm also getting like Leo, you you have definitely like made a name for yourself or something, and someone was constantly competing with you or something, and they're not understanding that there is no competition. Someone is weird. What's the advice for Leo? We have give here. One of the best feelings we can experience is giving to others. When we do so, we feel lifted up and our lives improve greatly because of someone else's happiness. Think of one way you can give to another today. So I feel like someone's giving to you or they want to give to you. To have a fresh start with you. But there's energies around this person that doesn't want this person to have a fresh start with you. It's like they refuse to see why they should give to you or something like that. Why this person should give to you. Any more advice for Leo? Yeah, fresh start, but it came in the reverse. You're being given the opportunity to begin again. Allow yourself to embrace this new life and open up fully to this gift that you've been given. But the thing is, I don't think you want this person. You could want this person, Leo. Not all of you want this person back. I feel like you have a good head on your shoulders, though, whether you want them back or not. But I'm just getting like there's energies around this person that did not want this person to give you a fresh start and why would you want someone like that but a bunch of rats around them and one more please for leo it's 
someone is no longer fighting you. Yeah, we have lighten up here and break free. You're being asked to remember that life doesn't always have to be so serious. Yes, there are hard things happening. No, it's not always easy to be here on earth, but you can always find time to laugh, be silly, and have fun. It's so important that you do so. Then we have break free. You're being asked to break free from the tribe in order to live your authentic life. This isn't easy, but it's very necessary if you're going to share your true self with others. Be brave, be real, be you, and trust that those who love you will always be there for you. So... I feel like someone is breaking away from this toxic person here and they want to make things light with you they want to make things um positive with you and not be so serious maybe this person was like overly critical or something yeah i feel like they were overly critical with you with their communication or something at first now they're not doing that So sure guys is reading Leo. Hope this one resonated for you. If it didn't, go ahead and like subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.